Thanks to the winner of the 1998 South Tamworth Bowling Club Talent Quest. It was broadcast nationally on SBS with some subtitles. And the guy who came second at the South Tamworth Bowling Club Talent Quest was a Hindu country music singer called Ranji. And Ranji sung all my favourite Hindu country music tunes like Thank Krishna, I'm a country boy. And <laughs> you picked a fine time to leave me, Vira Nisnu Sri Ramanamanamanamana. And mothers don't let your sons grow up to be cows. <laughs> yeah, <right up. laughs> Come gather round and listen to this tale of misery. It happened long ago at some poor girl's kitchen tea. It should have been a party, but things turned sour instead. There were stains upon the carpet and over 20 dead. It started out okay, I guess, as the ladies gathered round. The bride-to-be was happy with her crimpling dressing gown. The handy bin from Grandma would be useful in her home. And Mrs. Duke had painted her a handmade garden gnome. Then I melted a big section to a comment from her niece. And she responded angrily and kicked her friend Bernice. Fights broke out around the room and none got out alive. Of the kitchen tea, Tupperware Massacre of 1965. Of the kitchen tea, Tupperware Massacre of 1965. Oh, you've joined in lovely. Well, it turned into a melee, you could see the plastic fly. A gift trap beetroot strainer caught Kate above the eye. Red and yellow lunch boxes flew about the place And someone rubbed a cheese grater down Mrs. Porter's face A see-through freezer canister killed Mrs. Rostock dead A sawn-off salad crisper protruded from her head PVC had seven limbs before the police arrived at the kitchen tea, Tupperware Massacre of 1965. At the kitchen tea, Tupperware Massacre of 1965. Beautiful! Fifty years have come and gone since the bodies were entombed. The forensic squad sought evidence and ordered them exhumed. Well, they dug up Mrs. Henderson and the mother of the bride. They were neatly stacked in Tupperware, fresh and crisp as the day they died. <laughs>